Verona, its history, architecture, and a world-renowned opera festival. The Italian city recently hosted the 20th anniversary staging of the most prestigious opera competition in the world, Operalia. This is a unique competition. Generations of stars were first discovered at this contest. For 2013, 600 singers sent in their demo tapes, but only 12 made it to the final, an exciting show where they performed to an international audience made up of both opera fans and professional experts. Behind this competition, a great artist's generosity. I'd always thought of creating a rather different opera contest, one where I knew I could follow up with the winners, not just, here's the prize, now goodbye, but one I could work with them, we could give concerts together, invite them to the theatres I'm involved with. It should be for encouragement, to help with the various difficulties of this job and act as an accelerator for their career. Tomorrow's stars were judged by the creme de la creme of the world of opera production and management. Being part of the jury is a job, but above all it's a real pleasure, because here you make wonderful discoveries. Artists you didn't know about before. Young Chinese, Russians, South Americans. Here I found singers I and my colleagues then invited to our opera houses. It's terribly exciting when you first see a singer and think, wow, that's real talent. And one of the real talents was French soprano Julie Fouche, who came second. Ultimately, first prize went to a Russian soprano. I love opera and I live with this music every time, every second. So I want to learn more. I, I want to learn every day new music, new arias. And, and do you know what is the important thing, the most important thing? That the people will love me. That's, that, that's what I'm dream, dreaming about. Not just to sing somewhere, just that the people will love my voice, will love my soul, will love my acting. In the men's category, the winner was an extraordinary Chinese bass baritone. Before the final, actually, I want to sing Madame Mia from Don Giovanni Leporello aria, the catalogo aria. And, uh, but I just chat with Maestro Domingo. He said, if you sing uh, Maramina, you can play more. If you sing Aleko tonight, I did, you can sing more. And tonight I sing like, my voice is like, pew, it's like, I feel like blooming, it's, boom. it's so great. It's a privilege for me to be able to contribute to the growth of young promising artists into opera stars. It's so fantastic to be able to help. Together with all my family, we're working hard so that, God willing, this will go on forever.